So many big races to be decided across the country. More than 30 governor seats up for grabs, including right here in South Carolina, where you may have a new governor by this end of tonight if all the vote counting goes smoothly. And if not by the end of tonight, we have a new governor. Henry McMaster will be the longest serving governor in South Carolina history. We're going to head over to Orangeburg. That's where we find News 19's Nyjah Hood to tell us how voter turnout has been in that county. Orangeburg County voters tell me this election day they're making their voices heard. We need change. You understand? You know, especially for, you know, for the better. Because there's so much crime and stuff going on right now. Change, change, is, change is needed. Voters say their experience voting was quick and easy with no issues. Voter Jacqueline Bowman spent most of her day helping others get to the polls before casting her ballot. I grew up with the elections and everything, and I know what, how important it is for us as a black person, especially a black lady, to be able to come out and vote and voice our opinions to the public so we will know that we do have a voice. Polls close tonight at 7 p.m. For Street Squad Orangeburg, Nigel Hood, News 19, WLTX.